I knew that it was going to last. Because, girl, he cheated. He cheated. So, what made you think he ain't going to cheat on you? Like, girl, gone. 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 <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Shasha, and in today's video, you guys, we are doing a exciting, exciting video. We haven't been doing this in a long time, but as you can see by the title, y'all see the title. So, yeah, we're doing a video on we're doing a story time on the time I found out I was the sad chick. So, y'all, I done been in three real relationships. Just to let y'all know, but. Um, this is one time, no, this is not Trey, because I know a lot of y'all be saying like, oh, is she talking about her recent boyfriend? No, no, Trey would never, I hope not anyway. So yeah, today we will be talking about how I found out I was the sad chick, y'all. It was very, we gonna get to the point because honey, honey, when I found out, girl, it won't even funny. Like, I'm gonna let, let y'all find out though. Um, I found out I was the sad chick. I would say this was too. I'm not even gonna lie. I kind of knew like he was talking to someone because you can tell when your person has a sneaky link. So, um, yeah, I think I was in college. He wasn't. Um, and I would come home for the weekends and stuff. But this time he did not even want to come get me y'all because at the time I wasn't driving. So, um, he usually come pick me up or whatever. I didn't have a car. I was driving, but I didn't have a car. Honey, let's get it right. But, um, he usually come get me, um, from my apartment or whatever. But this weekend, he act like he didn't want to come get me. Come, this weekend, he act like he didn't want to come get me. So, I was like, mm, that's kind of like a red flag. Um, but I didn't pay it too much math. So he was like, I'll come get you next weekend, blah, blah, blah. He was like, my family hand this little get together. But I guess it was a cookout. Um, but I believed it like a dummy. But yeah, he said his family was having a cookout. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna let him be with his people or whatever. Cause I want to do the same thing. Okay. So, um, that Friday, well, this was Thursday. I was thinking he was coming to get me. Um, then Friday came. Usually he he um get off work he'll call or whatever the text or whatever, but this day he just texts. Honey, you supposed to be my boyfriend. You gonna call? You gonna text? And if I see that you're not blowing me up, I'm gonna think you're doing something, as I should. So um here lately he just I felt like he was you know acting weird. So I called and he would not pick up the phone. I'm like, okay, that's not like him, but I didn't pay it too much math. So, I say the afternoon came, and I'm like, okay, I haven't heard from this boy. I'm blowing his phone up. Keep him out. I'm blowing his phone up, but um, he's not calling me back. So, um, me and his mom was not cool at all, y'all. Like his mom did not like me because she she was saying how I'm gonna give her baby some grand. She was like, I'm gonna give her baby some kids. She don't want no grandkids right now. Girl, boom. So, she didn't like me at all. So, um, I couldn't call her and ask, like, where's your son? So, um, next thing I know, um, I'm getting a little frustrated because he's not answering the phone. So, I call his homeboy that I know that he worked with. So, I call him through messages. I'm like, okay, have you heard from such and such? I'm going to say D because his name's all with D. I'm going to say, have you... I'm going to say his name was D. So, I was like, um, hey, how you doing? Have you heard from D? He was like, yeah, I heard from that. You know what? 
this morning. I'm like, no. Maybe he, you know, maybe he just, you know, was talking to him, telling him what he was going to do. No, I think he was calling him to tell him, like, look, I'm about to do one of my little sneaky links. And, you know, I need you to, you know, bail out for me. But this one point. The boy was like, no, I haven't heard from him since this morning. I'm like, okay, you had time to call your homeboy, but you didn't have time to call your girl. Cut it out. So, I'm calling his phone. After I get off the phone with him, I'm like, okay, thank you, blah, 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 whatever. So, I get off the phone with him, and I'm like, dang, like, who else can I call? I didn't know anybody else that I knew because his little sisters at the time, they weren't really, you know, on their phones. They weren't really phone savvy. They was, like, young, but they didn't. I don't think they had a phone. At least I didn't see, never see them with one. So, I have no choice but to let the day go on. He was not answering the phone. I don't know what this, this hood rep was at. I don't know what he was at. But, I'll say about 9, 10 o'clock. Ding, ding, ding. My phone ring. I'm like, 9, 10 o'clock. You ain't talked to me all day, sir. Then you want to call me. And see what I'm doing. Make sure I don't cheat. Make sure I won't cheat in that day. So he could call me after he done did what he was going to do. What he did do. Because he did. So he called or whatever. I pick up the phone. I'm like, what you been doing? Like, I've been calling you all day. And he's basically like, oh, I was with my family. I've been really looking at my phone. Blah, blah, blah. Bullshit. So I'm like, mm, every time you around me, you on your phone, honey. So, he was like, oh, I wasn't looking at my phone, da 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 So, I'm like, okay, I brush it off. And next thing I know, he was like, I'm going to go to bed. I'm, I'm going to bed because I'm tired. I was helping my family prepare and do this and do that. So, I'm like, that was the red flag for me anyway. But I'm like, okay, you could go to bed. I'm like, not even thinking about it because I was like, he was with his family. Y'all, I said, I woke up the next morning with two, three messages, long paragraphs girl i about to say big long paragraphs from some girl that went to his school at the time i had graduated um i was in college but i think he was still in school i do remember he was in school because this girl went to his school so she's inboxing me she inboxed me on facebook i'm gonna say her name was shay shay it's about the same i'm gonna say her name was shay so she inboxed me she was like do you know d i'm like yeah, I know D. Like, why would you inbox me if you know I know D? So I was like, Yeah, I know D. Why? And she was like, Oh, um, I just want you to let I just wanted to let you know I was with him last night. And um, she was like, He got mad at me because I didn't want to mess with him. Y'all, I know this like the back of my head. She was like, I he was mad because I didn't want to mess with him. And um, she was like, He kicked me out his car. I was like. Girl, so you know, my heart was racing like I'm going on 10, I'm going on 20 at this point. So I'm like, I didn't know what to say at the at this point. I really didn't know what to say. And um, you know, the girl was basically telling me like I didn't want to mess with him. He kicked me out his car. Da da da. So I'm like, okay, like at this point, I didn't know what to say. So I was like, oh, okay. I was like, um, what's your name? Um, I was like, what's your nickname? Because I didn't want to say her real name. So I was trying to get the bo to the bottom of it. And she was like, they call me Shay. That's why I'm saying her name was anyway. So I was like, okay, I'm going to ask them about it. That's all I could say because I couldn't say nothing. So um, that morning, he still ain't called. So um, I think he felt like she told me. Like, for real, for real, I really honestly think he felt that she told me because he was acting, like, so, like, nonchalant and so, like, it is what it is when I asked him about it. But basically, he was saying, like, oh, I didn't do that. I wouldn't do you like that. Da, da, da. Y'all know how niggas do. So, I'm like, okay, I brush it off. And this girl was like, he did, you know, he did oral me, though. He did, you know, you know what I, what I mean when I say that. She was like, he did do that to me, though. So, I'm like, wow. So, I was like, okay, you know me. You know me. So, I waited, I think, three days. He was coming to my house. Y'all, when I seen that Negro, 
all I could do was that's all I wanted to do to him. That's all I wanted to do. So um that was the last no, that was the second to the last um time we broke up. Um and I broke up with him for months, like two months. I'm pretty sure he didn't give a fuck. But I broke up with him for about two months. I'm pretty sure he was trying to get that same girl, cause girl, he probably did. But um that goes to show y'all like these niggas and these bitches ain't shit. Because she let him do that, but she didn't want to fuck him. She didn't want to, you know what, she didn't want to do that to him. But you let him do something else to you, though. Like, girl, and you knew he had a girlfriend. And then you gonna inbox me, girl. What's up? I knew that it wasn't gonna last. Because, girl, he cheated. He cheated. So what make you think he ain't gonna cheat on you? Like, girl, gone. 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 We broke up or whatever. But... You know, I was so hurt, y'all. I don't even know why because this is not my first time, like, getting hurt by him. But this one was, like, really hurt because that was my first time actually knowing that he was really intimate with a female. Like, that was my first time ever having a relationship where someone actually cheated on me because that's still cheating. Like, I was the sad chick, boo. You cheated, boo. Like, he would be like, oh, I didn't do that to her. To this day, like, if I ask him, he'll still say the same thing. Like, girl, stop it. So, I mean, boy, stop it. But it is what it is, y'all. That was the time that I was the sad chick. I was very embarrassed for a long time because the girl, she was, she would, like, want everybody to know that, like, he did this to me. And I'm over here, like, but that's my boyfriend, like. That's my boyfriend. So, I felt real crazy, y'all. I did take him back. That's just the typical young girl that I was. I took him back. And the last time he cheated on me, that was the scroll because it was with the same girl, y'all. If y'all want to hear about that, I think I did that sort of thing. Y'all want to hear about that, then let me know, y'all. Like, when we broke up, it was like, I think that was one of my worst breakups in history. I did not want to let that nigga go, y'all, but I had to because he was just doing too much. And I feel like I was the nicest girl that someone can ever have. Still to this day, like, I feel like I, I don't cheat. Like, a, a man, like, have been with me. He can never, ever, no man that I was with can never tell you I cheated on him. Either I was single when I was doing what I was doing or I just knew I was single. I didn't want nobody. So I was doing what I was doing. But as far as being a, a real relationship, a man can never tell you, Shasha cheated on me. Never. I never cheated on anybody I was with, y'all. I don't plan to. I never cheated on anybody I was with. If we're in a relationship, we're in a relationship. So cheating is a big thing to me. Like now, I feel like it's a big thing. Like if I found out... Trey is cheating. I can't be with him anymore because I gave you too many chances. Like, this is the last straw. No matter when it comes to the kids or anything, I just can't do it anymore. So, if you're talking to my man, I will find out. And if he's inboxing you, oh, I probably already know. Okay? So, don't try me. But man going to be a man at the end of the day. So, honey, do what you got to do. If he can do it, dog on it you do it That's basically all i can say but i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you like comment subscribe turn on your post notifications so you can be notified every time your girl posts a video period i love you guys and i will see y'all in my next video bye